Wittoon 2.1 review. Hey guys, this is Shyam from IndiaAcademy.com and you are watching my Wittoon 2.1 review. So as you can see, I'm within the Wittoon 2.1 and during this Wittoon 2.1 review, I'll talk about what Wittoon 2.1 is and how it can help you to make more money online. Plus, I do have a ton of custom bonuses just for you for this Wittoon 2.1 review. In case if you like to check them out anytime during this Wittoon 2.1 review or after watching the Wittoon 2.1 review, all that you need to do is go down on the description of this video and click the link to my bonus page from where you can check out all of my bonuses. I'll give you a brief walkthrough of all of my Wittoon 2.1 bonuses as well during this Wittoon 2.1 review. But before going that far, I want to show you what Wittoon 2.1 is and how you are going to be benefited from this. Hey, welcome so, to this Wittoon 2.1 demo and as you can see I am within the scene so let me quickly describe you what this all interface is about. So right in the center over here this part is called the workspace. From here you can see the preview of the scene that you can create right. On the left hand side right over here you have on the left hand pane, right on the extreme left, you can see the different things that you have. For example, this is background. Then if you go to here, this character, now all the things that are included in that asset can be visible in this little window over here. Then you can also go ahead and add images and videos from Pixabay. It has got integration with Pixabay so that you can use the stock footage like videos and images within your videos to make them more interactive. You can also go ahead and add different icons you can also go ahead and add different GIFs. Now it doesn't stop there. It also gives you text animation. Like you can add different text elements. You can also add done for you text preset with motion animation done for you. You can edit everything of it. Like for how to write, what to write, what fonts to be used, colors. Everything is doable. I'll show you. Don't worry. Then there are a ton of transitions that you can add anywhere inside your video. Then comes the important part that is giving voiceover. For voiceover, there are two options. One, you can record your voice directly or you can use the text to speech that is built in. You can use Google voiceover or Microsoft voiceover as well. Then you can add background music. Now remember, you can also go ahead and add custom background music as well. You can even add your custom videos within it. So that's kind of cool things to have. The best part that I like about this tool is that it has got a scene creator as well. That means you can actually go ahead and create a storyboard out of it. Say for example, the first scene, you want someone to be on their office and then they come back to home and explain something like, so on the first scene, you can use all the stuff related to office so that they gives a scene of an office. And then you can actually add another scene where you can drive in to home. So that's how cool things are. And in between scenes, you can add transitions as well. That's up to you. Also, the best part, it allows you unlimited exports, full HD exports. That also of length 25 minutes. So literally, you can go ahead and create eye-popping videos in whatever length you wish to at full HD resolution. Again, so to show you everything, let's create a new project. So just click on that. And as you can see, now I can click on new and in here I can choose the dimension like I was talking about Facebook video, YouTube video, stories, Instagram videos, ads, anything that I wish to. So I'm going to choose YouTube video for this example and let us name it demo and click on create. You can see that the blank canvas has loaded. Now, as I already told you, this is going to be the work area and this is going to be our timeline. So first of all, we need to adjust the duration of the scene as by default, it is going to have a 20 second duration. Now, let us reduce this duration to about 10 seconds. You can see that, right? If you want to increase the duration, you can just click on plus. If you want to decrease it, click on minus. That's it. That's how easy it is. The second step that we are do going to do is insert different assets into our scene. So first of all, we will insert a background. So just drag it over here and then you can reposition it by dragging. And also you can resize it just like this. That's up to you. So that's how cool things are. Now, as you can see, the background has been added to our timeline over here. Now we can adjust the duration of the background just by dragging this. Or what we could have done is we could have gone to settings and in here we could have changed the duration. So that's up to you in which way you want to. If you want to flip the scene around, just click on that and you can see the positions change, right? So that's a cool thing to have. And then you can also have different animations on it as well. Now, once this is done, remember, you can also upload your own background to it. I am going to give you a ton of background as my bonuses. All that you need to do is go over to the second position over here and click on click to upload. And then you need to find the background image that we have. Say, for example, I want a gym. So I can just click on load 
and it would load the gym over here as you can see now we can again drag it over here we can resize it we can use it any way that we wish to now i'm not just doing it but i just wanted to let you know that this is possible to do right now once this is done we'll go over to the character and as you can see there are a ton of characters depending on the profession of the guy so this is regarding ac so maybe we can drag in this guy that is the appliance repair man and we can reposition him like this right so that's up to you and then comes the important part again we can actually manage the duration of the character via this drag and drop easy feature on the timeline now i want to show you how to animate the character so for that go over to settings and on the animations you can find it has different animation like running is there handshaking is there talking on phone is there driving a card is there speaking is there all of these are available also you can change the ethnicity of the character if i click on this you can see the ethnicity changes so that's up to you depending on where you are targeting your videos you can change the ethnicity at one click as well now with that being said you can also flip the character like this so that's up to you now i am going to show you one very interesting property that it has which is actually the move a to b property by which by the help of which you can actually move your characters within the scene to give it a more dynamic effect. So for example, let us suppose that this guy over here, I want him to appear from behind the screen and run into this position, just for an example. So what we can do here is that we need to select this character, go over to settings, and in here, we just need to click on move A to B. And as soon as we do that, a red flag appears over here, as you can see. So all that we need to do now is drag this red flag to the right side right and then we need to move it out of the scene so now what happens is that this guy will actually get into this position as we play the video so let's play it and see whether this happens or not yes it does right so now all that we need to do is give it a more realistic feeling like walking or running right so for that we again need to go over to settings and in here instead of speaking just give it a running feature and now let's play it and see how it appears so it appears more realistic right the guy is running now depending on the duration it will run faster or slower say for example if we give it a less duration say for example this one then you can see this time it will run a lot faster just like that so you can adjust that and give it exact feelings that you want to now suppose I want this character to actually stand at this point and tell something like, hey, I am the repairman, I do this, 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 just like that. So what we need to do now is again drag this character into the workspace just like this. Again, resize him into the size that it had previously. Right, done. Now we need to go over to settings again and flip it because it was facing this way. So we need to flip it again. So we have done that. And on the animation, we'll keep this as speaking, right? Now once done, we need to head over to timeline and adjust the timeline like once it has ran all the way into the center then it will stop and start speaking right so we need to start this character exactly when the first animation ends and then we can also increase the duration like this so now let's play it what would happen is that it will come running and then it will start speaking it comes running it stands and starts speaking that's exactly how to do it that's simple as that. Now you can add different characters. You can add 10 on 12 characters, whatever you wish to, and make a story out of it. That's a cool thing to have. Now to make the story even more interesting, we need to add voiceover, right? So for that, we'll go over to this microphone over here, click on that, and that will actually allow us to give voiceover in two ways. One is text to speech and the other is record your own voice. Now we can drag this into our workspace and you can see it has been added. Now we can also drag this to make sure that it appears in the right time like the guy was running up to two seconds then it stands and starts speaking so we can start the recording from here right then we would go over to settings and in here we will just click on this microphone and it would start the recording for us. Now if you don't want to record your own voice you can always drag the text to speech into your work area and again it has been added over here now in the similar way you just need to go over to settings and in here you can find the script you can write whatever script you want to and it will actually produce a voiceover for you it can be a male voiceover or a female voiceover as well if you have a google api key integration it will actually bring in the google voice as well which sounds more human like now with that being said it comes for free of course so if you want to integrate you can do that definitely so that is how you add voiceover to your videos
then you can also go ahead and add background music to your videos whatever you want to you can also add a different video altogether as well right inside of this video that's how cool things are you can even go ahead to pixabay and add for images and videos stock images and videos that is you can add different icons you can also add different gifs as well so that's how powerful this tool is with that being said i am also going to give you some characters as bonuses that you can add within your vid tool so for that we need to go over to characters and in here we'll scroll all the way down until we find a click to upload so just click on that and then say for example this is one of my character files so if we click on that and click on load you can see a brand new character has been added in this way i am going to give you a ton of characters as well that you can readily import within vid tool and start animating things how cool is that now one last very important feature that i want to show you guys is that the zoom in zoom out feature that they have added so for that we need to go over to this layer light on top which is the camera layer as you can see on the left hand side now we need to click on this and then we need to move the cursor to exact timeline where we want the zoom in say for example at this point i want the zoom in so i will click on the camera icon over here and i will drag this camera angle up to this point so it will zoom into the character right and then once this is done i'll just move it on the last point and i will again click on the camera and this time what we will do is that we will actually zoom it out so this time we are going to keep this screen right up to the end so that it zooms out so that's how it will so that that's how we can apply the zoom in zoom out effect that means it will zoom inside of the face and then zoom out we can again change the duration on the timeline and we can make sure that it exactly zooms in and zooms out in the way that we want to so that's how easy things are and once you have done you can just click on save project and you can just click on render and export say this is demo so if we click on export i also want to show you how fast rendering is possible on this so you can see it's happening on real time i'm not cutting this so that you get to see how fast the output is and boom it has been done so if we go over so let's play this you can see the guy runs in talks about something zooms in zooms out perfect right so if you spend a little more time you would be able to create masterpieces using this so that's how cool things it is and as i already told you it has got this scene features you can just go ahead and add a new scene all together over here now this can be any scene that you imagine and you can create stories just like that using vidtoon 2.1 so i really hope that you guys have enjoyed this vidtoon 2.1 demo and if you are really looking to pick up vidtoon 2.1 then why not via my link because i have given you some amazing custom bonuses which you are going to find nowhere else with that being said if you want to check out my bonuses for this vidtoon 2.1 review you need to go down on the description of this video and click the link to my bonus page which should take you to my bonus page that should look like this and in here you can find any and every info on vidtoon 2.1 review everything is written over here so if you wish to check out that you can do that anytime by going down on the description link with that being said all that i want to show you is my custom bonuses for vidtoon 2.1 and it contains anything and everything there is video maker pro there is tube traffic machine javascript commission bot there is high ticket siphon there is cloud content rewriter app i have also given you gemini i have given you instant traffic i have given you yt rank analyzer i have given you octane pro i have given you quantum commissions i have given you wordpress training I have given you commission shortcut, take it pro, webinova, funnel builder. I have also given you Microsoft Ads training kit. I have also given you WP training kit, which is a WordPress training kit. I have also given you WP members builder pro. Then there's high ticket hijacks. I have also given you ecom video maker, cartel, TikTok video maker, local video monster. I have given you master freelancer pro. So from this, you can make a ton of money with Vidtoon by selling 2D animation video on fiber or other marketplaces then there is aurora there is profit maximizers and there are ton of other softwares as well you can just go through this bonus package at your own time i'm not really going to waste your or mine time in discussing all this because there are more than 200 plus softwares that you can have and also there are some extra bonuses in case if you pick up any of the otos or the bundle of vtune 2.1 and 
And again, all of these are premium bonuses, as you can see, but I have created some awesome bonuses for Bitune 2.1 with it. Like I've given you easy copy, which can write scripts for you from where you can create animated videos. I have given you create an agency, which can actually help you in creating animated characters that you can import with Bitune. I've given you NFT builder that helps you to create NFTs. I've given you infographics bundle 2.0, which contains a ton of graphics that you can use with your videos. Now I've also given you search stocks, which contains millions of searchable stock footages. I've given you 3D animator Pro, which gives you animation videos on 3D. And then I have also given you tune bags, which is a collection of tune backgrounds that you can readily import with Vitune 2.1. But remember, all of these bonuses are on an upgrade or on the bundle of Vitune 2.1. With that being said, if you like Bitune 2.1 and all of my bonuses, and if you want to claim them, all that you need to do is go down on the description of this video, click the link to my bonus page. From there, you can scroll down, check out all of my bonuses as I've walked you through. And then you can click on any of these red buttons to go over to the Bitune 2.1 sales page. That should look like this. And in here, you can check out the sales page at your own time. I'm not really going to waste your or my time in doing that. And from here, you can click on any of this button to get access to Bitune 2.1 for you alongside that you are also going to get my awesome bonuses for free of course now to get all of my bonuses you just need to email us your purchase receipt on our email id as you can see over here or you can contact us on our facebook page with your purchase i receipt as well and and we will deliver all the bonuses to your inbox with that being said it's time for us to discuss the pricing that it has the front end is going to cost you 49 bucks unlimited export 25 minutes full HD. That's what you are going to get. Uh, with that being said, you are not going to get any templates with this. If you want to get inside of templates and more characters and more animation assets, then you need to upgrade with the OTO one, which should be the Vidtone Club. It should cost you around $67 monthly charge or $149 yearly charge, but it has a one-time payment option as well, and it should cost you around $197. But this is a launch only offer that you are going to get. With that being said, if you are really looking to get inside of the Vidtone Club, which will actually give you 120 additional templates per month. Plus, it is going to give you 150 HD templates straight away. Plus, it is going to give you 1600 animation characters and hundreds of full HD background. This is what you are going to get with the template club. And if this sounds interesting, if you really want to get hold of template club, then I would suggest you go for the bundle offer because on the bundle offer, you are going to spend around the same money but for the bundle, you are going to get additional software, like you are going to get Voicely, which is a premium voiceover software, and you are going to get Streamer, which actually allows you to translate your videos into multiple language at one click, and also it is going to help you with your live stream. Now, all of these would cost you around $297 if you go for the bundle deal. To go for the bundle deal, you just can scroll down on my bonus page until the end of it, and here you can find the bundle deal. You just need to click on this and go over to the bundle sales page, and from there, you can get hold of your bundle deal as well. With that being said, there are a couple of more OTOs, like the OTO 2 is there, which is Voicely, the one that I talked about, which creates human sounding voiceover. And then there is the streamer, which actually helps you to create multilingual video translation. It gives you transcription. It gives you all the things that you want to. And it's going to cost you around 49 bucks if you are going to pick it as a standalone software. With that being said, there is a OTO 4 as well, which is Vitun 2.1 reseller, but it is going to be costly. So if you want to really get inside of it, you can. But what I suggest just you pick up is that you should go for the bundle deal as per my recommendation because the OTO one that is the template club makes your life easy as a developer because there are a ton of templates on every niche which you can edit and produce breathtaking videos just like that so if you want to get inside of it then I would suggest you pick up the bundle at $297 because you are going to get two extremely powerful apps alongside that that is Voicely and Streamer so with that being said, it brings me to an end of this Bitune 2.1 review. And I really hope that you guys have enjoyed this Bitune 2.1 review. If you have, please help me with a like and let me know in the comment section if you have got any questions regarding any part of this Bitune 2.1 review. We'll meet again pretty soon somewhere over the internet. Until then, please take care of yourself and your families. This is your good friend Shine bidding goodbye from you until we meet again next time with some other videos on making money online. Signing off is Shine from NK Academy. Take care. Bye-bye.